cheers. Everything is concentrated at the bottom, so the closer I'm getting to the bottom, ooh, the yuckier it tastes. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, you're gonna be coming along as I drink turmeric juice for seven days. So if you guys are not familiar with turmeric, it is the ingredient in curry that gives it its yellow color. It originates from the Indian subcontinent as well as Southeast Asia. The property in turmeric that gives it its medicinal qualities is called curcumin. I really hope that I'm pronouncing that right. If I'm wrong, please correct me in the comments down below. So the reason why I wanted to try turmeric is because it has a lot of benefits for skin allegedly so some of the benefits for your skin that turmeric has is apparently it's supposed to help with acne it's supposed to help with wrinkles it's really an anti-inflammatory spice so thus it's supposed to help with redness and just decrease puffiness it's just supposed to make your skin look really good whether you're applying it topically or whether you are ingesting it this is just what i have read online from people's anecdotal evidence now as you guys know my skin has been looking pretty good recently the main thing that i'm dealing with is just looking overall exhausted the bags under my eyes the redness i just feel like although yes in the acne department I'm doing pretty good in the other department in terms of looking glowy and refreshed i'm kind of lacking i feel like it's because of my lack of sleep it is because of stress and just a bunch of different factors in my life poor diet so i'm hoping that turmeric will help to detox my body and just help to rejuvenate my skin and just to refresh it because it is very much needed some of the other benefits of turmeric because it is anti-inflammatory it is and it is an antioxidant it's going to be really helpful for brain function for preventing brain disease for preventing heart disease apparently it helps to prevent alzheimer's and especially it helps to treat and prevent depression nevertheless it's just a very healthy spice and i'm just going to be ingesting it for the next seven days to see what the heck happens to my body so if you guys want to see what happened to my skin and my body for the last seven days as i drink turmeric juice then just keep on watching all right so this is what my skin looks like on day one. First of all ignore this i'm filming a henna hair dye video and this is something that i have to do for the video so in terms of my skin right now i feel like acne wise it looks really good i don't really have any breakouts right here i do have some scarring which i know that the turmeric drink is supposed to help with inflammation so hopefully it will help with the scars here also i do get red as you guys know i just like get red around the cheeks so hopefully it will help with that the main thing that i want to that i want to get out of this turmeric drink is hopefully somehow it'll help me get better sleep because I feel like my poor sleep lately has been affecting my skin. I think that, first of all, I have like bags under my eyes, which doesn't look good. And although I don't know if this is related to my sleep schedule, I've also just been feeling like my skin just looks sunken in and not as glowy as it usually does. So I'm gonna drink the turmeric drink for the next seven days, hoping that it will help my skin to just look more awake and lively and less sunken in maybe like although it's supposed to reduce inflammation maybe it will just like add some glow to my skin because it is supposed to be really really good for your skin so I feel like everywhere else in my body looks glowy and nice i don't know my face like lately i've been looking in the mirror and i just feel like my skin just looks bleh not really in terms of acne but just like it just doesn't look as glowy as i feel like it usually does and i think it may have something to do with sleep Maybe the turmeric mask will help. It's honestly just been within the past like couple days. As you guys know, I've been using the Dove soap, which has been making my skin look amazing. But other than that, I guess the one complaint I do have, as I've been saying, is just the fact that I feel like I look really, I feel like I just like look sunken in at certain points of the day. So that's really what I'm trying to get out of this drink to try to add some liveliness to my skin. So yeah, let me just do one more close up shot for you guys. Okay, I know my skin looks good. Like, I don't want to play games here and say it doesn't because it does look good. It's just like around my eyes. It just, I feel like it just looks sunken in. Everywhere else looks good. It's just around here that I, that I would like to improve on. Even if there isn't that much to improve on in my skin, it would just be great to see how the turmeric drink affects my skin, if it does affect it at all. So yeah, I'm really interested to see. This is the area that I break out 
in if something is irritating my skin so if it's not working well for me we will see right here or on my hairline everything else with my skincare routine is going to remain the same and finally i know that most of the benefits from the turmeric drink well the things that i'm looking for is hopefully just like skin wise even though i don't have that much to improve on it would be cool if i could see some improvements there are also a bunch of other benefits of the turmeric drink which i i'm sure i've already mentioned in this video so hopefully will help me in those areas like with sleep and stuff and just feeling more energized and less tired and less headaches. I feel like I sound crazy. So this is my skin on day one and yeah, now on to the next clip. All right guys, so I'm gonna be making turmeric shots. So you could also make something called the golden drink. But within the golden drink, almost all the recipes that I've found have incorporated coconut oil or some sort of oil. I am trying to be oil free right now. So I'm not gonna do the oil, although they do say that having oil with turmeric helps your body to absorb the turmeric better. I'm gonna do turmeric shots. So in this turmeric shot, you have one and a half cups of unsweetened coconut water, juice from one lemon, two tablespoons turmeric, I keep saying turmeric, turmeric, and one tablespoon of black pepper. So, these ingredients, the coconut water, we have a lemon, the turmeric, and we have black pepper. They recommend that you mix it in like a blender bottle, or you put it in the blender, but I'm just gonna mix it in the blender bottle. definitely not a shot i'm just gonna read maybe there's like more than one serving in this because this is definitely not a shot shake the shaker bottle then pour the shot take the shot it's not a shot one and a half cups of coconut water that is not a sh you can't fit this in a shot glass anyway let's taste it i ended up putting honey because when i looked at the ingredients in there i was like this looks really gross so hopefully with the honey, it's bearable. All right, here we go. Mm. I don't know if I would have been able to drink this without the honey. You should definitely like continuously mix it because everything falls to the bottom. Okay, so I'm still drinking this. It's actually starting to make my stomach hurt a little bit. So I kind of feel like maybe you're not supposed to drink this much because if it's a shot, I don't know, but I'm gonna try to finish it. I can't drink anymore. I drink like over half of it. That's good. So that's day one. I'm gonna be drinking one of those every day for the next seven days. This is skin on day one. Hey guys, so it is day two and this is how much of the turmeric drink I'm gonna have today. Yesterday was just way too much. Honestly, I feel like if I'm getting the same amount of turmeric, I don't feel like there needs to be that much coconut water. This I definitely consider more of a shot than yesterday, but it's still not a shot. Oh, and I still need to show you guys my skin. Everything is concentrated at the bottom, so the closer I'm getting to the bottom, ooh, the yuckier it tastes. I feel like I've only been drinking this for one day. This is literally my second time drinking it, but I do notice 
a little bit of a difference in my skin. The thing that I noticed is exactly what I had mentioned yesterday, which was that my skin has been really red recently and my skin actually doesn't look that red at all. Like usually it's red here. It is a little pink here, like don't get me wrong, but I feel like it doesn't look nearly as red as it has been looking, probably due to the drink helping with inflammation. Also, I did work out today, so maybe that has something to do with it. In terms of me not looking so sleepy and looking more awake, I mean, I feel like I look more awake, but at the same time, I am just going to be honest with you guys. I feel like we're not going to see results until like the middle of the week if we even are going to see re results. Although, yes, I can still see the bags under my eyes. I don't feel like they're as yellow, although I don't, I don't know. What do you guys think? Oh, by the way, just everything else related to the turmeric drink besides my skin today i did feel like i had a lot more energy i don't know if energy is necessarily a result of consuming turmeric but let me look it up anti-inflammatory arthritis diabetes detoxifies liver improves skin health helps in wound healing promotes weight loss improves digestion in terms of digestion i don't really know last night after i drank the turmeric I had a really bad stomach ache. I think it was because my hair smelled like henna, which I filmed a video on. But anyway, I think that that's why my stomach really hurt. I also had heartburn last night, so I don't know if it's helping me in that regard. Maybe it was because it was the first day. It has been shown to be an extremely effective natural mood enhancer. I'm interested in the mood booster. I actually do feel better mood-wise today. I've actually been having a really good day, so maybe the turmeric is helping in that regard. I know this video is mainly dedicated to how turmeric is going to affect my skin, but. I might as well just tell you guys how it is affecting everything else so this is the end of day numero dos but with that being said i will see you guys on day four hey guys so it is day four now and i have my turmeric drink here i do have some updates i haven't talked to you guys since day two sorry that my cat is kicking in the litter box right now i don't want to disturb him okay i'm gonna just take a sip of this and then i will start to let me just take a sip of this and then I will start to update you guys. By the way, today I didn't put honey in it because I've had ice cream today. That's too much sugar for me. So So I have some notes written down. I have been taking notes on pretty much the way I've been feeling physically and the way my skin has looked. I haven't been focusing solely on my skin. I've been just thinking about physically how I'm feeling after having the turmeric drink. So on day three, I worked out at the gym and I had a lot of energy actually. And I worked out in the morning. So the night before was the second night that I had the turmeric drink. I'm typically pretty energized in the morning, but not as energized as I was on morning three. And so on morning three, I actually drank the turmeric drink after I worked out because I wanted to see how I felt. I also felt, okay, I wrote this down. I also felt like on day three, I looked uglier. So it seemed like the turmeric was, I mean, I can't even definitively say if it was giving me energy, but like if anything, it may have been like giving me energy, but just in terms of the way my skin looked, I don't feel like it looked that good and then my headaches went away which i don't know if i mentioned this but i've been having really really bad headaches and actually ever since i started to drink this i don't have headaches anymore i don't know if it is the turmeric but i stopped having headaches so today i feel like my skin is a lot more glowy i felt like i looked really good today by the way the last time that i had the drink prior to drinking this was yesterday morning so there are some things that happened last night that i think may have been affected by the fact that i didn't have the turmeric before bed but anyway let me just continue reading so yeah today i felt a lot more glowy i felt like i looked really nice my hair looked good i just i liked my appearance today in spite of that i only got four hours of sleep last night and it's interesting because i did not have the turmeric drink before i went to bed last night i had it the morning before so maybe the turmeric does help me fall asleep or does help me sleep i don't maybe it just like helps my body to like feel better so thus like my body just like is back to normal where it's like sleeping regularly energized in the morning versus like not getting enough sleep so i didn't sleep 
that well last night at all i was a zombie today i came home from work and i took a two and a half hour nap so even though i did feel like i looked really glowy today i did feel like i looked tired because i was tired so now i just want to share with you guys some things that i found online so i was looking up on whether or not there are any side effects from having too much turmeric according to a website called rxlist.com turmeric is possibly safe when it is used in an enema or a mouthwash in the short term all right i'm not asking about that so according to rxlist.com turmeric usually does not cause significant side effects however some people can experience stomach upset nausea dizziness or diarrhea in one report, a person who took very high amounts of turmeric, over 1,500 milligrams twice daily, experienced a dangerous abnormal heart rhythm. However, it is unclear if turmeric was the actual cause of the side effect. They're advising not to take turmeric in high doses. But the interesting thing is that after I was reading that, I realized that although I know it says like stomach upset and diarrhea, I haven't had diarrhea. However, on night two, I had really bad heartburn after I had my turmeric drink. I get heartburn, but it's actually pretty rare now, but on night two, it was bad. Like I needed to take two Tums. It just felt like my chest was really, really heavy and it was definitely heartburn. So it could have been the turmeric, although I'm not taking 1500 milligrams twice daily. So first of all, the turmeric and the pepper and the coconut water actually make my lips like kind of bigger. I don't know. I think it might be the pepper, I don't know, but my lips just like feel bigger and they look bigger after drinking this. But this is just what my skin looks like. It still looks pretty good, but I am noticing like a little bit of irritation. In the grand scheme of things, when you just look at my face, I felt like I looked really good today. So maybe it was a turmeric, but at the same time, I do notice that I did look a little bit more tired than usual which makes sense. However, I can't really like collectively say if this is the cause of the turmeric. I am just sharing with you guys what has been going on. So hopefully, now that I'm drinking this, I will go to bed at a de decent time. Tomorrow morning, I will update you guys and let you guys know how easy or difficult it was for me to fall asleep. I just wanna manifest a good night's sleep. So I'm going to manifest that I'm gonna fall asleep. What time is it? It is 10.30, I'm gonna manifest that I'm gonna fall asleep in one hour, 11.30. Okay, so I'm gonna go take a shower, go to bed, and tomorrow morning I will update you guys on how I slept last night. Hey guys, so it is the next day, and it's actually the end of the day, and last night I slept much better, I got a much better night's sleep than I did the night before, and I also had so much energy today, I didn't have any caffeine this morning, and I went to work, left work, went right to the gym, and it is now 10.30 and I'm home. So I was really energized throughout the day. And again, I had zero caffeine, which is so rare. Just in terms of the way that my skin is looking, I do have makeup on and please bear with me because I'm really tired because I've just been like busy all day. But I do feel like my skin looks better today. Please ignore the makeup running underneath my eyes. But yeah, I feel like my skin looks better today. I actually feel like I looked really good today. I feel like my skin is glowy and I just physically feel better. I feel like, yes, the turmeric seems to be good for acne. However, because I don't have that much acne, I think the way it's working for me is it's just making me feel a lot healthier. It's making me sleep better and it's giving me more energy throughout the day which translates to my skin and the way that I look. It just makes me look more awake, makes me look more glowy, which then makes me look better. I just think it is overall doing good things for me. I feel like definitely if you have it in excess, it's probably not good, but I am not having it in, in excess. I'm having a pretty good amount and I think it's working pretty well. People may be saying, well, like you just started to drink it. How could it be having these benefits right away? I can't tell you guys 100% if it's the turmeric. All I know is that for the past couple weeks, I've been having really bad headaches and I haven't been sleeping well. Now that I'm having the turmeric, I am physically feeling better, which is again, translating to Sorry about that, my camera just died, so I had to switch cameras. That is how I feel like it's working well for me in making my skin look good. It's just making me physically feel a lot better. It's making me feel a lot healthier, which obviously translates to your skin. But now I remember what I was saying. My point is that I feel like a big lesson from this video that we can all take is that 
A lot of times with skin, we're so focused on the products that we're using, making sure that we're using like a six step skincare routine, even though I don't even practice that, making sure we're using face masks, making sure we're doing all these different things. At the end of the day, a huge part of skincare is your diet and your physical health. If you're not healthy, if you're not getting enough sleep, your skin is not going to respond well. Now there are those people out there who have amazing skin, don't need to get good sleep, don't need to work out, don't need to do any of that, their skin just always looks good. But there are a lot of us who do have sensitive skin, whose skin just reacts to whatever is going on in your body, it will react. If I'm having stomach issues, my skin will react. If I'm stressed, my skin will react. If I'm not sleeping well, my skin will react. So I feel like the turmeric drink seems to be a really good detox drink because it's making me feel a lot healthier, which is translating to my skin. So if you guys are having skin issues, like even if you don't wanna try the turmeric drink, just try to drink more water, try to eat healthier, try to work out. I'm not saying that that's gonna cure your skin problems, but it will help you to look a lot more awake, lively, and glowy, which will definitely help you to A, feel better, and B, look better. So this has been my update for day, I don't even remember what day we're on, but I actually drank the turmeric drink right when I got back from the gym. So I am about to take a shower now and then I'm gonna go to bed. Tomorrow I will have the turmeric drink at night again. Hopefully everything will go well. Hopefully, hopefully I'll get another good night's sleep. If I do get another good night's sleep, I'm going to attribute it to the turmeric. I actually kinda wanna look up right now if turmeric actually helps with sleep. Okay. At its base, turmeric reduces inflammation, lowers your blood sugar levels, help your, helps your liver to detoxify, boosts your immune system, and eases your digestive system, all of which help you to get sleep faster, to get to sleep faster, to sleep better, and to wake up feeling refreshed. So, yes, it definitely does help you to sleep, which clearly it's helping me. So anyway, I am going to end my night and I will talk to you guys and update you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is the next morning. So I just wanted to tell you guys how I slept last night, how the turmeric drink has been impacted my sleep last night because I feel like although I said that it did seem to help me sleep the past few nights, I just wanted to like make sure that it was the turmeric drink. Again, I don't know for sure, but I can say that the previous week I had to take melatonin multiple times to fall asleep. This week, including last night, I did not have to take melatonin and I fell asleep fine. So I feel like last night just kind of solidified it for me that the turmeric drink is definitely a good detox drink to help you just be a lot healthier. As I said, I don't think that it's necessarily affecting my acne. I don't really have that much acne as it is, so it's not really working for me in that way. It's just making me feel a lot more energized and just like look a lot more awake and alive because I'm getting better sleep. And again, as I said, when like your whole body just like is doing a lot better health wise, I feel like it reflects in your skin. So one thing that happened to me today that kind of confirms again, how the turmeric drink is working really well for me is just that someone at the gym approached me and complimented me on my skin and asked me what products I was using. I told them like the face wash that I use, which is just Dove soap and the jojoba oil and tea tree, tea tree oil, but I also mentioned the turmeric drink because again, Again, although it's not really doing anything for acne because I don't really have that much to work with with acne and then the redness it does seem to be helping with the redness just making me feel a lot better physically which I think is definitely reflecting into my skin so that is how it is working well for me I'm gonna try to do this twice a day although I only have I think two days left of this including today I am gonna try to do it like in the morning although it's not the morning it is like midday I'm gonna try to do this now and then once before I go to sleep so I have the turmeric here and we may have ran out of coconut oil I and mean, coconut water. We ran out of coconut water, but that's not a big deal. I will just use this smart water. Okay. And once again, I'm not going to use a sweetener because I don't really think that that helps at all. Besides making the taste a little bit more bearable. And I'm going to make this, whoops. I'm going to make this more of like a shot amount oh 
that's a lot, okay. All right, this is how much I'm gonna use. Cheers. It's not as bad with just the water. Although you have to keep mixing it because everything's gonna fall to the bottom and then that last sip is just gonna be really, really, really hard. Oh yes, another thing that I wanted to comment on, which I'm not sure if this is related to the turmeric, but we're about to find out is just the fact that I've been going to the bathroom a lot more. So let's just look this up. Is turmeric good for bowels? Some evidence suggests that taking curcumin, a chemical found in turmeric daily for one month can reduce bowel movements, diarrhea, and stomach pain in people with Crohn's disease. It helps with indigestion, bloating, and gas. So maybe it's like cleaning out my system. I don't, I don't know. But I mean, there's just so many things that it's just like it gets to a point where you're like, okay, how much of this is real and how much of this is just like assumed or people are just saying. But from my own experience, let's see so far. Increased bowel movements, better sleep, more energy, better skin due to the fact that I am feeling and looking a lot healthier and glowy. By the way, if you guys are looking to do this, it tastes a lot better without the coconut water. Just do it with straight up water and pepper. So tomorrow is the last day. This day is over and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so I'm just doing my makeup now, but this is actually the last day of the turmeric cleanse and I just wanted to update you guys on how yesterday and today went having the turmeric twice a day so as i told you guys yesterday the turmeric like okay i don't know if the turmeric is making me go to the bathroom but i found a correlation between me taking in a lot of turmeric and going to the bathroom so it hasn't been like a negative experience with going to the bathroom. And when I say going to the bathroom, I mean like going... Hold that thought. So just to continue with what I was saying before, I don't like... When I looked up online if turmeric leads to increased bowel movements, I couldn't find anything. But I did find that it does help with like indigestion, which leads me to believe that maybe it would help to clean up the digestive system. That's one of the things that I'm experiencing from this. I found that a lot of times whenever I try like some sort of detox, if you guys haven't seen my celery juice video, I'll put it in the cards and I'll link it down below. I have like increased visits to the bathroom and it seems like with the more turmeric that I'm having, the more visits the visits to the bathroom that I'm having I don't think it has to do with my body like having a negative reaction I think maybe it's just like helping to clean out the digestive system I'm not a doctor so I can't say if a is causing B but it seems like there's a correlation going on so that is something I've noticed also I went to get Botox today and before you guys like freak out it's for my jaw because I have TMJ it's like for medical reasons it's not for cosmetic reasons anyway the lady that I saw again complimented me on my skin and this is like another compliment in addition to the compliment that I got yesterday. Acne wise everything is fine but I think it's just that my skin looks a lot glowier. It just looks a lot better and it's you know glowing it just looks really good so I think it's just because physically I've been feeling a lot better. No headaches, sleeping well, and it's transferring into the appearance of my skin. So that is awesome. I'm just doing my makeup now because I'm actually going to film the intro and outro to this video. But basically in sum, I feel like the turmeric drink definitely was a really good detox drink to help me physically feel better and to help me look a lot better. And I feel like my skin responds well to that. So this video isn't really a lesson in like turmeric will clear your acne. I can't say if that's true because I don't really have that much acne right now, but it is a lesson in the fact that if you're healthier, if you're feeling better, then your skin will respond and it will show through in your skin. So take care of yourself, your skin will flourish. Also another thing is that I'm not gonna do this like every day. I feel like with things like this, like with the celery juice and just like with different 
like cleanses or like fad diets i feel like your body just gets used to it after a certain point so i don't want to do this anymore i think this week i'm done maybe i'll just do it like twice a week from now on i'm also kind of skeptical about like adding this into my diet every day for like a really long period of time anyway i'm going to finish filming finish up this video and i will see you guys in one second all right guys so that is that we are done with this turmeric juice cleanse detox situation so what's my final say on turmeric juice i feel like it's a really great detox and it's something that you can make at home you don't need to go to whole foods to buy the little shots it's really easy to make at home you guys can just buy this at your grocery store mix up the concoction yourself and it will help to rejuvenate your skin and your body with that being said, I cannot tell you guys if it works for acne. My acne isn't that bad right now, so my current situation is not a good example of whether or not turmeric helps with acne. So in that regard, I can't tell you guys if turmeric helps with acne or not. However, I can comment that I didn't get any acne this week at all. Also, I found that as I have been repeating throughout this video, turmeric has helped to rejuvenate my skin and just make me look a lot glowy and healthier, which I feel like can help prevent acne. If you guys are struggling with cystic acne, I'm not going to tell you that turmeric is going to save you because I just first of all I don't know if it will second of all I don't really think it will so don't quote me on that but that's just my opinion however I can say that I feel like when you change your diet you're trying to be healthier your skin is going to respond but also don't forget to drink lots of water because that is another really big aspect of making sure that you are healthy and making sure that your skin is looking good all right so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video I love all of you if you guys want to check out turmeric then just check the description and I will link the exact spice that I use down below don't forget to like this video if you guys enjoyed it also if you guys are not already subscribed don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. Oh my gosh, I'm so annoying. Okay, I love all of you and I will talk to you guys next time.